Multiple top WWE superstars are currently out with an injury, with a new name reportedly being added to the list. It seems like what happened on the latest episode of Friday Night Smackdown had an unfortunate purpose. Jade Cargill was taken out backstage on the show, before being sent to the hospital. WWE released an update on her, stating that the storm suffered multiple injuries, including a bruised kidney, an MCS brain in her right knee, and facial lacerations, among other things. This was done to cover her real, life situation. It was initially reported that Cargill was actually injured, but a new update has suggested she will be out for a minimum of three months. Dave Meltzer reported in the Wrestling Observer Daily Update that those involved in WWE Creative were told Jade Cargill won't be back until at least February. While the nature of her injury remained undisclosed, with Cargill holding the Women's Tag Team Championship alongside Bianca Belair, it remains to be seen what happens to be the titles. The EST of WWE may very easily get a new partner, with Naomi an obvious choice for the role, but she could also vacate her belt in solidarity with her fallen friend. Warning, Smackdown spoilers ahead for November 29, 2024. The final episode of Smackdown ahead of Survivor Series was taped this past Friday. Jade Cargill was initially supposed to face Minshin and Piper Niven in a Women's United States title tournament first round match. Obviously, she couldn't make it and had to be replaced. Lash Legend took the Storm's place but was unable to get the victory. Meanwhile, Cargill's spot in the Women's War Games match at Survivor Series was taken by Bailey. The full effect of her injury on storylines will be seen in the coming weeks, particularly with what WWE has planned for Bianca Belair. Sports Kida Wrestling wishes Jade Cargill a speedy recovery from her injury and hopefully, she can return to the ring better than ever.